Hey guys, it's Keandra and I'm back with another video. Don't mind my AC in the back. It is hot in Texas, as you guys know. But this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to do a half up, um, half down style with a U-part wig. This U-part wig is from Unique's Hair. It is in 20 inches. Um, I used to, I feel like, I thought I had a video like this on my channel, but I guess I don't. Um, but I don't mind, I'll redo it just for y'all. Um, I do look crusty, so don't mind that. I'm trying to find in my little um, whole beauty shop I got over here. I'm trying to find some moisturizer because your girl hair is dry. Um, sometimes, like I hate doing, um, sometimes I hate doing hair videos with my natural hair because people think my hair is dirty when I really just have scalp psoriasis. Like I really cannot stress that enough, y'all. My scalp is dry. I can put moisture, heat, not heat, moisture, grease, oil, all that on it. But then I have low porosity hair and it just takes forever to absorb. So no matter how clean my hair is, it's always gonna be dry, y'all. And if y'all have anything I could use for, you know, dandruff, scab, psoriasis, let me know but i feel like i've tried it all like sulfur eight works sometimes but you know it's a hit or miss so right now lord ah, as you guys know my hair is short because i big chopped last year and then i decided to perm it <laughs> well it's not like super short like it, it got some length you know it got some length don't do me it got length but it's not as long as it used to be if i care enough i'll insert a picture or a video of my hair what it used to be but y'all them um them what is it called and i'm just adding some leave-in strengthener by mega growth i don't know my grandma be giving me old hair products she don't use no more um I had a, it's not a midlife crisis, but I was just going through some stuff. And as you guys know, hair holds energy. So I just said, F it, I'm gonna cut my hair off. And that's what I did last year on Valentine's Day, F it. I cut all my hair off and started over. And honestly, being bald was fun when I was a wig reviewer. I don't review as much hair as I used to anymore. Cause honestly it gets old I'm not gonna lie like reviewing hair gets old but oh my gosh y'all I started using this product because I had a bald spot and it's like already working I will probably make a reel about that because I think I have to review a TikTok or not review but review the product doing a TikTok so just keep a lookout for my uh, shorts on that hair product but I definitely had a bald spot over there I thought I had alopecia. I don't know where it was coming from, but um, it's growing back. But anyway, back to this. So I used to review a lot of wigs. So when I was bald, oh, it was great. Like I loved reviewing wigs when I didn't have no hair because I didn't have to worry about um, my wig. My wigs were flat, um, and I didn't have to worry about braiding. Okay, so now I have to make a U. Okay, so I have my front out. And then I need to make, act like I have like leave out. I'm so confused of what I'm actually doing. I think this is what I want. So that the wig can clip here. I think so. Ciao. Anyway. All right. So this is what we're gonna do. And yeah so i'm gonna do about this much out and then i'm gonna put the rest in a ponytail because i don't need all this hair out this is probably a really ghetto tutorial and honestly to be completely honest y'all i like ghetto tutorials i want someone to just come get straight to the point 
it don't have to be perfect but the end result looks great like that's what i want that's the type of content creator i want to be i want to be the content creator for everybody it's no pressure to be perfect and yeah so i'm gonna take the back of my hair y'all see that ponytail don't blame me y'all see it um and i'm going to put it in a ponytail and if y'all see some flakes, mind your business. I told y'all I got scalp psoriasis. Okay, and so this is what we have. We have like a little whatever shape that is. All right, so here is the wig. It has three combs, two on the side, one in the back. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this here. Hopefully it fits, because it's already too big. It is already, see? I knew this was gonna happen. It's already too big. So that's fine. I can put it there actually. That might be better. Okay. Put these side ones in. And then this one in the back. And now I should be able to comb it up. Mm -hmm. Okay, we gotta fix this one. Comb it up over the wig. Now, this is kind of hard to do if you have like thin hair or short hair, because I have thin and short hair. But it's okay, because we're gonna make it work. I feel like this is, what are we doing? Having trouble with this side, guys. Hold on. There we go. Okay, great. So now that we've covered the front of it, hopefully all of that was in frame, we're gonna take some from the wig, which, let me brush this out. I have been using the um, curling headband by Rogue Curls. If you haven't seen my short or my TikTok on this, definitely, definitely go check it out um and that is honestly the best thing like so my curls are like still kind of like curled inside each other but that's the best thing for heat curl heatless curls like if you don't want um your hair to smell like burnt hair from using flat irons and curling wands that is like your best bit so anyways my hair I'm trying to get it out of the curl there we go all right so now you're gonna take some hair from the top don't worry about that side piece. We're going to come back to that. Top. Top. Okay, y'all. I'm going to have to bobby pin this down. Give me one second. Okay, so because this wig has these flaps right here, I'm going to go ahead and bobby pin those. Because I don't think my hair is long enough to cover it. Not on my temples anywhere. Like, this is where I have my ball spots at. So now I can like cover it because it's not sticking up. I'm gonna do the same thing on this side with a bobby pin. Okay, cool. All right, so this is the hair, my hair, and I'm gonna put the hair of the wig, split that in half. bring it to the front all right and then I'm just gonna conjoin it with okay did the bobby pin not work okay the bobby pin didn't work no worries it's gonna get fixed I'm not worried really and truly it's gonna get covered anyway all right and so now that there there we go. We're gonna take our hair tie and put it in a ponytail. And it doesn't have to be perfect because we're gonna go back in and hide everything that's showing. Okay, so now I can go back in, hide that. I'm gonna put a bobby pin here.
Like this is literally bald hair friendly. Well not bald bald, but short hair friendly for sure. And then I don't know how this side got got missed. <laughs> but got this side too. And then Okay, so now that we have all the tracks and stuff covered, we're gonna take my hair. Let me find, make sure all my hair is right here. Okay, take my hair and we're gonna wrap it around because they don't blend. We're gonna take another bite pin and stick it. Okay. And then now, I'm gonna comb the ponytail out so it looks cooler. And then the hair. And then, I'm trying to see if I wanna, I feel like I need another bobby pin back there. Where are my bobby pins? Hold on, let me get another Okay, so I found another bobby pin. Stick that there. Cool. Then this is all the hair to the front. Okay, so now we're gonna do baby hair. So I'm gonna take this Kiss Edge Fixer, actually, yeah, okay, my Kiss Edge Fixer, Max Hold, and Sweet Peach. And this is okay. They honestly don't move all day when I use this um, edge control, but I also have a relaxer, so my edges don't move anyway. <laughs> And that's all I really do. I do my little three swoops. If you want it to be flatter, you guys can tie it down, which I probably will. But this is pretty much it. Because my hair was already curled from the headband, curling headband thing, I don't have to go in and curl it. I mean, I could, like I might fix this one. But actually, I probably won't because I don't care that much. But yeah, so this is how you do half up, half down with a U part wig. This is what the back looks like. Hopefully, it looks okay. Hopefully, it looks okay. And uh, yeah, super quick and easy. It's very secure. It's not going nowhere, period. So yeah, if you guys like these quick hairstyles, then definitely like comment and subscribe and until next time bye guys